Hi everyone, Chris here. I hope you're all doing really well. Today I wanted to make a video about Skrill. It's something that we do mention on the Profit Skrill site and something that I've seen being discussed in the members group and on the forum. And I just wanted to go over what it is and how and when I recommend you use it. So basically what it is, if you've ever used PayPal, the e-wallet, the virtual wallet, it's basically exactly the same thing. But what Skrill does is it tends to sync up to more bookmakers than PayPal does. So it's a great tool for moving money between bookmakers. So picture the scenario, you have 50 pounds in Ladbrokes that you want to transfer to Bet365. One way to do this is to withdraw that money into your bank account and then deposit that into Bet365. But the trouble with that is that it often takes a few days for that to happen. It can be slow to come out of the bookmaker into your account and then vice versa, you gotta then deposit it into the Bet365 account. And the whole process can be a bit slow and cumbersome. Skrill is supposed to relieve that issue and it does and it does it well. You can actually transfer money between the bookies really fast and that's great. Uh, but just one thing to be aware of is that for some offers, you're not actually eligible if you deposit using Skrill. And Profit School will always tell you if you're going to be ineligible for the offer when you use Skrill. And as a backup, you should always just have a quick skim of the terms and conditions yourself. But it is something to be aware of. So for example, many of the sign-up offers that bookmakers have when you're sort of bet 10, get 30 or whatever, you have to use a debit or credit card when you deposit for those offers. We say it in the tutorials, we say don't use PayPal and I'll add to that and say don't use Skrill for those offers. Also for the daily reload offers, it's not hugely common but there are some of those that say you can't use Skrill, you need to use a debit or credit card. Where Skrill really does excel is with casino offers where you're doing those expected value offers or the risk-free spins and you're moving money between the bookmakers in order to do that. There's absolutely no problem in using Skrill there. You'll still qualify for those free spin offers and uh, all the rest. So if that's what you're doing a lot of, I'd say get yourself on Skrill. It's completely free to sign up. I'll drop the link below and you can also find the link in the members area and that should help you a lot and save you a lot of time, which is really valuable. Another thing I will point out with Skrill is that if you want to withdraw money from the e-wallet that you have with them into your bank account, they will charge you a fee for that. So I suggest trying to avoid that. The best thing to do is say you have £100 in your Skrill account that you want to withdraw into your bank account is to pop that into a bookmaker first and it's fast to do and then withdraw from the bookmaker into your bank account because there won't be any fees that way. If you're doing a lot of match betting, then you'll qualify for the Skrill VIP plan, which doesn't charge you any fees. So that's quite easy to do once you're moving a lot of money around, but it can take a few months to actually qualify for that. So in summary, always be aware of the terms of the offer. Look out for what Profit Skrill is saying. Look out for what the terms and conditions of the offer are saying. But as long as you meet those terms, and especially on things like casino offers, where you don't have to worry about that, I'd say Skrill can be a great time saver for you, freeing up more of your time to make more money and complete more offers. Have you used Skrill? Have you used any other softwares or e-wallets in order to move funds around? We'd love to hear from you in the comments below. Please drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it and also hit that subscribe button to never miss out on anything from Profit Squirrel. Thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you all really soon.